All right, let's check. It's been like a week before they've thrown anything out. Oh my God, these people in there. easier right now. scolded in my comment section about <laughs> carrying things to my car. Oh, it's another one of these. It's all smashed. That's okay. I already have one. out you guys but it's really heavy okay oh that's all broke all right there's stuff caught making my life harder Red cranberry. Yum. What are all these things? They had glass in them and they broke. Alright, I'll figure it out in a minute what I'm gonna do. All these darn candles, they make my thing all slippery. get the cardboard out of one of these like this. Oh, <laughs> the candle made it all slippery. Tear broke. Oh, I hope that works. Yes. I'll show you guys when I get home. But yeah, that glass is broke, you guys. I can't keep messing with all these projects. But like I said, I'm not the only diver. projects, uh, they can take the rest of the stuff.
Ay, ay, ay. That is heavy. Something's in there. Get out of my way. Okay, guys, I feel like I'm spending too much time at this one spot. There, but I did see something back here and I want to peek it. That's a little kid toy, that'd be cool. other side. Okay. That should be it, guys. Alright, let's check the next spot. Alright. Just got over here. Are those displays? Or I don't have a wire cut cutter to cut that wire, but you know, I don't know. I'm gonna have to get a wire cutter or something, something next time. Hold on a minute. I don't 
know if there's any oils in there, but look at this. Oh, that smells strong. So. Hmm. All right. I'll get my box in a minute. you guys that's one of those uh, sinus cleaners and this doesn't look like any fluid has been in there okay I'll have to investigate that more some type of charger. Let's just set this in here. And I 
scored this uh, bag of dog food that wasn't opened. And that's the kind Winnie eats. Another van anymore. Oh, that's a display too. And honestly, you guys, I don't know. I already have one. My daughter has one. in that whole damn display. And again, remember, I am, I'm not the only diver. Oils are cool because I have an uh, aroma diffuser. Okay. Violet something, but those all feel like they've been run over by the dumpster truck. And this is the dumpster that hasn't been dumped like in like a whole month. It's weird. I'm gonna wait for them to dump that. Trust me guys, I've been taking those home and most of them are full. And that's heavy, but it's just cause stuff is on it. Please handle with clear, uh, care glass. That feels heavy. display units. Huh. Interesting. Okay guys, well I'm gonna go through this at home and I will show you at the end of the video um, what was in there. All right, let's check somewhere else. I'm not sure what's going on here, but we're gonna find out.
Oh, look at this. Oh, I love these little organizers. Uh, thank you. What's this? Olive oil sprayer. Okay. okay let me get down for this one for a minute. There's the lid. Got my car window open right here. out and they're mean. Oh, there's only one in there. Yep, and it's broke. Okay. Oh, it's all torn up. you guys oh my gosh oh my god oh, I will get that off it's an UGG blanket I told you guys I have been oh my gosh I'm freaking out I'm freaking out because I told you guys they used to throw stuff away and they haven't been lately oh my god believe I just found that so now it's time to find something that can get that off of there what's this oh my god it's another one oh my god what is happening right now what is happening it's too that is heavy Okay, you guys leave a comment down below. I'm gonna be searching tonight online for something that I can order to wash the blanket and to get that off of there. Wow. Cause if we, is this an UGG? That has way too much spray paint on it. to you guys I don't know oh. I don't know guys that one has a lot of spray paint so let's just leave that wow. I can't believe I just scored those Holy freaking moly. Everything is broke. Okay. I am in total shock right now.
two-tier boot. That's cool. I cannot. All right, let me get my pokey. Let me get Mr. Pokey. There's nothing even wrong. There's a what the heck? Oh. Is that a blanket or what is that? Things been jamming. Welcome. Okay. it up. you guys that is so beautiful there's just that little little chip and that's it and that was it I cannot believe I have been checking every day every day for these uh, ug, ug sheets I was even looking but they have blankets Okay, let me just peep this other side for a minute. So I am going to call, I'm gonna call a friend of mine and see if she wants to come and get this. Cause it's spray painted and you know guys, I just don't wanna mess with that. I just, not with kids and one of those houses that I need the glass for. Oh. It looks like it's already really damaged. Oh, that was that little lid. Hold on here. Yeah, there it goes. What was that? Okay. 
need one of those panels of that glass. There we go. Oh, all three of them are broke. Dang it. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Okay, I'm about to give up. <laughs> I'm about to give up. All right. Because I don't think that one had anything wrong with it either. Oh my goodness. All right, guys. I'm done. I'm going to call someone on that kid toy, but again, I feel weird oh, let me put this glove back on so I don't think there's anything wrong yeah I've got to figure out something on helping me get that spray paint off of those butter crock and this thing was broke but this is still in there. That little thing. Huh. I know you guys are probably like, why didn't you take this or take that? Here I get this. You know, I'm going to leave this for someone else. Like I said, not the only one, but I'm taking what I want. And I guarantee when I come back tomorrow, all of that will be gone. So, all right, let's hit the next place. Okay. There's gotta be something. So it's been a few days. out of the way now. Nothing. Is that a bag of stuff down here? Okay. I'm gonna have to get it somehow. these and they're awesome. It's a cute jacket. Oh, look at that little chin jacket. I'm going to order me one of those magnets and get that off. 
that's on my to-do list. That is on my to-do list. Something's in here. Heather. <sighs> Paris Hilton. broke that. Okay. All right, let's, I've got my little container here. Let's, let's bring it. That is the cutest little jean jacket. Uh, I'm not sure what that brand is, but And Kylie. Can't, wait, you're kidding me. Kendall and Kylie Jenner have antibacterial. <laughs> I mean, honestly, what don't they do? Oh, that's hilarious. Uh oh. I hear that thing going behind me. The uh, compact. something in there because it's heavy. Come on. Let's see. I can grab it this way. There we go. Oh. My dad's getting slippers for Christmas. <laughs> Anything else? Well, I don't think there is. Just looks like all those foam things, but I do want to see what this. It out somewhere. What a royal pain in the butt. What's this? Conduct your own ten in one experiment. Just, I'm debating right now. I'm like, I think if I even try and wash and donate them, you know, if children's hospital ain't gonna take that. Okay. 
Okay. I think that's it. But there's a box right here that I want to peek. So bear with me, guys. One by one. I'm gonna go crazy. So. Of course this bag is really in here. Another jacket. There's that glove. guys all right there's not uh there won't be any um organization here as far as which stores and um i pulled everything out of but we're just gonna roll with this because i have so much to show you guys and um so let's just get started here is the jean jacket that i pulled out of um Bur uh, burlington burlington co-factory so nice I need to order one of those magnets that removes those sensors because I have a lot of items that have the sensors on them. So um, we're going to find something on Amazon or whatnot. All right. And then look at this beautiful, is that not a gorgeous little bathroom garbage can? It is really, really nice. Um, there was nothing wrong with it. I think there might have been like a little tiny chip right there and that was it so yeah what a beautiful beautiful piece there so happy it didn't break in the 
when they threw it in the dumpster. Um, and then um, here was a candle here. It was a sweater weather. It was a little cracked, but again, uh, perfectly brand new, awesome candle to add to my collection of like a hundred. <laughs> Speaking of candles, there's like three more here that I got out of the Burlington dumpster. Um, right here is some ornaments. So last night it was late. I didn't film, but I did stop at TJ Maxx and I found a couple, couple items, not too much, but, um, there were two boxes of these ornaments and, uh, there were two broken each one. So just consolidated here. So have a whole box of perfectly, um, good ornaments. All right. And then next here are these little containers. Um, not even oh this is from bed bath and beyond yep that you saw in that clip and love those i will use my little spray paint remover to get that off um next here was that cute little elephant and it has like a little uh scent um whatever you call it but it's in the body there um and it smells really good it's, i think it's, uh, it says lemon grass and uh, ginger um, it had that little part right there broke off but honestly you, I could just paint it silver and it should be fine it's so darn cute all right and then next you guys we have right here is this spray all you do is put your olive oil in it and uh, use it here let me see what we can say here it says it's perfect for grilling and roasting and sauteing, nonstick cooking, basting without brushes. Just add any type of olive oil and spray on your favorite foods, including pasta, salad, pizza, um, less fat, more flavor. So you just fill it and pump and spray. So that was kind of cool. And uh, the next here, I, I know I'm not going to say that right, Le Crusette. Um, I know this is a very high-end item because I did look this up, and it's $40 for this guy. That little top part was broke, which was okay because when I looked this product up, you guys, um, they actually sell something very similar to this by the same company, and it was for um, holding your cooking utensils. So I can figure out something with that. For $40, I was not throwing that in the trash, so... All right, and then um, those were some of the oils that I scored out of Bed Bath & Beyond. Um, yeah, those two long things that I pulled out with all the other samples. Um, I actually need to get those out of my trunk. This was part of some other parts of it. But yeah, there was probably like 25 of these oils that um, I scored, so that was really nice. We have an aroma diffuser, so I'm going to use those. Um, here was from Bed Bath, um, I'm not Bed Bath & Beyond, I always do that. Uh, Bath & Body Works, uh, found this in the bag there. Um, I don't really use those things, so to be really honest, I've read that those oil burners that you plug in um, aren't really good for pets. So I don't really use those, but maybe someone will like those. Um, Alright, and then here... Uh, Kendall and Kylie Jenner, which was interesting. Um, they attach their names to a lot of products, but um, some antibacterial wipes. This I got at Five Below. It just needs a new bulb. Um, that it was broke, but I love those. Um, so that's that's really cool. My daughter has one of those rock salt lamps. I think that's what they're called. And um, but yeah. All right, guys, and the next was these Fila shoes. There is nothing wrong with them at all. To be really honest, the size was messed up because I'm an 8, and these were really tight on me. So I'm going to say they're more like a 7, but uh, my girlfriend is a 7, so Jo Lynn, I'm sending you those. They are so cute. I was kind of bummed. Um, but yeah, and then here was from Burlington that you guys seen in that in my clip and this is by Paris Hilton and look how cool this is. There's nothing wrong with it. So it has the lipsticks, the eyeshadows and the blushes and um, bronzers. So that was pretty cool. 
Um, and then you guys, I was uh, just looking around at this other area. I had a doctor appointment and I just stopped and peeked in this one dumpster and someone was throwing away their personal trash and most of it was just junk. But um, so this three's company <laughs> season six uh, disc was in there. How cool is that? I don't know for those of you, my followers that uh, you were in around in the era of Three's Company, but that was one of my favorite shows growing up. And I was just sharing this with my daughter and I was telling her, uh, I think that she would really like this, um, this show. She likes like The Office and Friends. I was never a big Office or Friends fan. Don't, don't hate me for that. I, I don't, maybe I just need to watch it. I never really got into it, but um, she's into that kind of stuff, so I think she'll really uh, get a kick out of this Three's Company. All right, and then if you've seen in Burlington, it was those uh, broken mugs, but this Godiva hot chocolate was in there, so I just ripped that out. Um, and then just some hand sanitizing wipes from Burlington, and then these two plates. Um, the other ones were broke at Bed Bath & Beyond, but these two were perfect. And if you see seen my uh, past clip where I got those really beautiful bowls that were this color, um, I'm just changing my dishware over to, uh, this color anyway, so that worked well. All right, guys, well, let me set up the next clip. Okay, guys, so here is this little guy that I found at Burlington, and he works. <laughs> PJ Masks. Okay, isn't that cute? <laughs> the night we save the day. Woo! All right, that is going in the donation box, so I'm sure some children are going to love that. Um, and then I was at Party City. Um, God, they had a bunch of stuff at the bottom of the dumpster, but they had all this heavy, tons of stuff. I would have had to have taken so much stuff out of the dumpster to get to everything, so I was kind of bummed about it, but I was... I was able to grab what I, I could, so I know, champ, you like that toy? You like that guy? Okay. Um, this Pop the Pig, I did open it and everything is in there. Um, yeah, so at Party City scored that. I actually have some other uh, box games that I found, and I'm going to go get those out of my car in a minute so I can show you, but those are all going to the donation box. Uh, two more candles from Bath and Body Works, and then this candle was from Burlington. Uh, red cranberry smells delicious. Um, these earrings from Burlington, and that pit, this picture frame. Look how cute! The glass was broke. Who cares? Uh, it's cute just to clip the little photos in there. And then. Um, scored these memory foam uh these are going to my dad dad if you're watching i'm gonna send you these um everything is in there box wasn't open so i don't not quite sure why they why they threw it away machine washable that's pretty nice um scored this from the burlington this try charts really nice so you have put that in your car and then you have the reports there so that's pretty cool um, and then just this miscellaneous, I found this at Ulta, um, and it's brand new. You could see it is a brand new lipstick, and it's by Clinique. So not sure what the story was with that. I still will wipe it all down um, just to be safe. And then from Burlington, you saw that I grabbed these two trays, and I grabbed the bottoms. The mirror was broke. But you know, you guys, um, I can do like that chalk chalkboard paint. And um, I can do the chalkboard paint, and uh, I'm sure someone would enjoy these. So I'm going to, I have a box I've been putting together of all my little projects, and I'm trying not to overwhelm myself, but I put a list together of the stuff that I need to order from uh, like Hobby Lobby and whatnot. So I'll probably do a video in the future here of all of the projects that I fixed, um, the things I fixed, and I'm sure you guys will will like that okay and then this I got at five below and it has the markers in the back and this is so pretty it has these glitter backgrounds um, so yeah I am going to 
You can see the markers are right there. Uh, that's going to go in the donation box. And uh, I, like I was saying before, I went to the doctor and then I just stopped at a couple places. And all the Walgreens where I live are on complete lockdown. You cannot get into any of the dumpsters. Um, they have like a brick wall built around it with the locked fence. So that's a no-go. But there are a, once in a while I've been finding um, a Walgreens that is just out in the open and... Uh, found this one Walgreens and thrown this whole box of band-aids away this eczema cream and it was in a clear package I took it off um, a completely unopened brand new eczema um, Aveeno calm and relax stress relief moisturizing lotion and then this backstab uh, stabilizer like crazy I know Walgreens is awesome too I mean you can probably find so much awesome stuff there especially like after the holidays so I'm going to check that uh, Walgreens dumpster periodically. Maybe I'll drive over there like once a month, but uh, it is kind of a little trek. But anyways, then you guys seen I pulled this Black & Decker out, uh, Dust Buster. I don't know anything about this as far as how, if it's a, if it's a display or not. So I'm going to have to look up a YouTube video and see if it had a charging port for this or what's how do i charge it i don't know but i'm gonna find out and try and figure out if this is a display or if it's usable and i'm really hoping it is because that would be awesome all right and then i pulled this out of the um bed bath and beyond and it the little thing was broke here darned it um, so anyways, it had the parts in there inside, so I'm going to fix that because that would be a beautiful decor piece. If you've seen one of my other videos, I scored a beautiful bowl that matches that and it's gorgeous. So, okay guys, I'm trying to keep a very steady hand for you, um, but I am going to set up the next clip because it's going to be awesome. I'm going to show you those Ugg blankets, so... Here we go. All right, guys, so here are the Ugg blankets, and they're just amazing. This one was a full queen comforter set, and so is the other one. Um, it did. It does come with the shams, as you can see right here. Oh, my gosh, look it. So here's the only freaking problem. That's where they spray painted. Now, um, a while back, someone left a comment in one of my videos, and I have been searching and I can't find it, but someone left a comment about a product that I can order that uh, helps wash out spray paint. So I'm not sure, um, but the other thing is these say dry clean only, so I can't throw them in the washer. I, I guess so any tips that you guys have, um, please let me know in the comments down below. Uh, what you think I should do with this because I don't know what to do. Um, I'm going to call the dry cleaner first and see what their thoughts are and then if someone knows of a product um, that's worth it. Otherwise, not sure what I'm going to do with that one. But this baby right here is perfect. They only spray painted the other side and it's very lightly. Um, so look at this, you guys. And the shams are so beautiful. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe this. I have been trying to find, I have been on the hunt for these. I'm like, I am going to score these at one day. I'm not going to stop looking. And wow, you guys, I mean, you know these are like a couple hundred dollars each. So yes, awesome, awesome score. And uh, again, if you guys know of any idea or what you think, I should do with this guy right here. I would really appreciate it. All right, guys, uh, one more clip here. I'm going to show you the rest of the stuff. Okay, so um, I stopped over by Pet, I think this was Pet Co., um, throwing this whole little dog carrier away. Um, nothing was wrong with it, except it smelled like smoke. So someone that had it was smoking so I um, did spray it with my Tide antibacterial fabric spray and it's much better now um, but yeah how cute is that little carrier um, these little waste bag dispensers which um, I need so that I will use that 
Um, look how cute this is, you guys. It's a little bikini for a, for a dog. <laughs> it's so darling. And then this cute flannel shirt, which is going to fit Winnie so perfectly. So I will have to post some pictures of him in his little new flannel shirt. Um, next was this reflector uh, dog um, jacket. And it has its own little zipper pouch there. Um, so, yep, those were some nice scores from the pet store. Um, and then, you guys, at Burlington, if you saw me pull that coat out, look at this coat, you guys. It's a guest coat. It is so, it's a, one of those long ones. And look at the price, $79.99. The only problem was the zipper was stuck. I mean, it was stuck. And it was ripping right there. But it's in the inside. So that's nice. You can't see it. Um, I worked on that last night and I got it out and the zipper works. Um, and my daughter is so excited. It's a small, so it fits her. But look at how beautiful this coat is. And they just threw it away because the zipper. That's insane. So anyways, what a beautiful, beautiful find. So I'm glad that my daughter will get use out of that. Um, and then you guys uh, scored this, the uh, steam, steam pocket mop. And flip the head and blast away. Um, yeah, never touch a dirty pad again. Um, yeah, so awesome score. I looked this up. This was $99. And everything's in there. Uh, they didn't cut the cord. They did spray paint a little bit, but I don't care about that. So, yeah, you guys, amazing, amazing finds. Um, it's been an awesome week. Okay, friends, this is the last bit here. So I found these three pans at Bed Bath & Beyond. As you can see, they did do a little bit of damage there. I'm going to try and clean them up. If not, I'm not going to use them. But I thought the red was really pretty, so we'll see what happens with that. Um, then I pulled these out of TJ Maxx. There's the stemless wine glasses. I love those. Um, there was just one broke, and the other three were just fine. So nice little glasses. Um, then I pulled these out of Burlington, and this was from Burlington as well. So that's cute. Uh, that's going in the donation box. Um, this is what I found at Bed Bath & Beyond. The only part was that base was off, but um, I can use some heavy-duty glue and fix, uh, attach that, that weight um, for this. But, yeah, I have one that's, like, forever old, and um, so I'm just going to replace it with this one. Um, these two I found at Party City. And again, I was so bummed because they had so much stuff at the bottom of the dumpster, but they had heavy, heavy pallets and tons of things. Um, there was just no way I can get to it, but I did pull out a couple there. This is some adult uh, for grown-ups, so that's kind of cool. Um, and then last was this wreath from TJ Maxx, and it was originally um, $25. So these little trees came off. And I kind of want to have fun with this. So I think I'm going to jazz it up with some little characters um, that if you guys saw my last video with that beautiful candle holders that I scored from uh, Bath, uh, Bed Bath & Beyond. I am so sick of getting those mixed up. From Bath & Body Works, those beautiful gold candle holders. And they had these little trees like this. And they had the little glitter um, rabbits and there was a fox and whatnot. Um, so I'm going to go check out Hobby Lobby, maybe Michael's and see what I can find to add a little scenery, um, to this wreath. But isn't that pretty? And I think I'm going to put that on my front door. So yeah, guys, that's the end of this. And my dog just knocked over the whole light. <laughs> oh, it's okay, champ. Anyways, you guys have a good rest of your day. If you enjoy the video, please, please, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps my video. And if you're new, hit that subscribe and notification bell so you don't miss any of my future videos. All right, guys, have a great day. And until next time.